Good evening, everyone. My name's Heath Haskins, Code Primate, and we are back in Lumber Tycoon 2. And I, I did this at the wrong time because the sun is just about to go down. That was a horrible timing on my part. Uh, anyhow, I'm back on my um, slot number two, base number two, and I'm looking around. And I'm like, things getting messy. It is getting messy. It's time to clean my base. And uh, one of the main things I'm going to get cleaned up today is going to be all these axes and I've got bins for them over here. I have not filled these up with uh, anything in particular after this point because I don't have any blue bone turkeys and uh, I think everything else has been sorted. Uh, I think I might have room for spoons maybe but uh, I might even have a spoon or two in here somewhere laying around. But I can't remember so I'm just going to do that. Let's go ahead and start in with some uh, fire axes. Why not? Whoa, 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 whoa. Seriously. Fire axes. No, no, let's not close that. Fire axe. Goodness. So, um, one of the things that I've noticed about my ADHD is that I tend to not finish projects. Like cleaning my room or cleaning my base, or leaving projects right where they were. <laughs> By the way, that's uh, that's still the ball project over there. Still working on that thing. Uh, I don't need to chat. I'm in private server. I was in public for a second, um, but it was... Ooh, backpack's full. Backpack's full. Um, I was in private server for just a second, um, but... Or no, no, no. I was in public server for just a second, but then... Um, I had to update my drivers for my graphics, which by the way, I'm running on right now. Um, if you watched today's other video, then you will know that I did a collaboration with my daughter and we finished out our, oh goodness, no, I'm going to have to watch that. Uh, there we go. We finished out our um, human fall flat series. Like, from so long ago. Oh my goodness. Uh, my daughter, she's like, can you go back through there and put in, like, a disclaimer? Just saying that, uh, I'm like, no, kiddo, it's it's fine. It'll be fine. They'll know. They'll understand. Oh, goodness. Uh-oh, backpacks, backpackers four again. All right, so let's do chicken eggs. Chicken axe is going to be in the next one. So it goes fire axe, chicken axe, no particular order. Uh, and then we're going to go a zero drop. If if I get all the axes cleaned up in time, I'm going to start back in on my um, Palmwood Bridge 2.0. If not, then that will be the next video. That's not a thingy. What? Where did you come from? Should we do end times axes right here? Why not? End times will go right there. Thank you so much for the subscribe, whoever that was. Beautiful individual. Subscribing to the highest quality of content. Code Primate. Uh, whoops, nope. I said end times axes next. All right, get out, get out of here. Get out of here. Come here, end times axe. Thank you. End times axe. Hmm. And end times X. I know we just got started, but uh, <coughs> coffee break. <sighs> mm. Mm. Well, um, I guess what I could do is, since we're up to seventy six thousand, I meant to do a seventy five thousand special, but nothing happened on it. Like it was, it came and went so fast. You guys are amazing, because there are so many people who have subscribed within the last five days that it's it's jumped. It is completely crazy, crazy. Um, give me ideas. What do you want me to do for a, a special of some kind? The milestone episode. And just so you don't get me wrong, I. I'm not really big on the milestone episodes because I feel like it gives glory to the subscriber count, but I mean, it is a significant thing to have a bunch of subscribers and as celebration, I, I think you should do something for it. 
but it's never been about, um, oh, I'm gonna get 50 billion subscribers and awesome. It's not about that. It's always been about making content, family friendly, having fun, and like giving you guys a good message and a good feeling. And that's, that's what I want to deliver. I want you guys to feel good coming away from my videos. I want you to feel like you've learned something, that you've grown a little bit. I don't know, it just, it makes me feel cheap. I feel cheap whenever I'm doing episodes and I do like a giveaway or I do some kind of contest to, um, to say, hey, thank you subscribers. Because it, it never feels, it, it always feels like I've tried to buy my subscribers when I do something like that. Anyhow, I know it's not, and I know that it is in good intentions and stuff like that. So, I don't want you guys to feel bad about me doing giveaways and stuff like that either. So, whenever I am doing them, just know that it's, it's for you. It's not for the subscriber count. It's not for... Um, intentions of trying to get more subscribers because I, I am giving away Robux or I'm, I'm giving away items or I'm giving away playtimes, anything like that. It's never, it's never that intent. I don't ever want anybody to ever feel that way. Um, one of the comments made me say that because this is one of those, oh, well, that doesn't make sense at all. Wait, these are rookies. No, the rookies need to go over here. No particular reason. Just they have to move. You can't be in here, buddy. This is end times axis. I'm sorry. There you go. <laughs> it's okay, but um, yeah, be in here with your brothers. Yay, family. Actually, can I? Oh, buddy. The rookies are going to be the only ones organized. <laughs> That's going to be funny. People are going to be here, over here like, Oh my goodness, there's so many end times axes. These are amazing. And then they're going to be like, What is wrong with you guys? Why are you all lined up? And they're like, Military! <laughs> Alright. <laughs> this thing. I don't even... I shouldn't even keep this around. This is this is the biggest failure ever. Like, my avatar doesn't even slide on it. That's just... Ugh. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Even the failures are uh, are a good thing. Wait, what did I pick up? Yeah, I'm doing I'm doing beta axes. Yeah, let's do betas. Beta. I guess alpha become comes before beta. So let's do let's do alpha first, and then we'll do beta. So, come here, alpha. Ooh, I have an idea. Let's do a poll. If you like the alpha axe, and, and this is strictly, this isn't off function. Don't go off function. We're going off design. If you like the alpha axe, do a hashtag alpha in the comments. If you like the beta axe, do hashtag beta. Hashtag beta. And the, the other thing I want you to, uh, actually, don't tell me, okay? Because I was going to ask, if you're a boy... Put in hashtag boy. If you're a girl, put in hashtag girl. Don't don't do that. Just tell me which one do you like. Do you like the alpha or do you like the beta? Um, because I have a theory. I don't know if it's a true theory or if it even if it's even viable. But um, I like the pink axe because it's so unique and different. But I like the beta axe because it's blue, and it's, it's more closer to my favorite color, which is purple. But the uh, the idea is like girls like the pink axes and then boys like the the blue axes, but that's that's completely just a theory. And don't don't hold true to that. If you if you're a boy and you like the pink axe like me, just absolutely do hashtag alpha. All right. Oh my goodness! I just realized our um, marble machine is going to be in the way. Of our axe bends. No, don't bend away, axe bends. Uh, alpha drop. Okay, that's kind of cool. Did you see how it like? Oh no, that's not cool. Wrong side. Okay, that was that was a mess, but it, it, it works. It works. There we go. And drop those in. There you go, ladies. Or or boys. You could be boy axes. Ooh. 
<laughs> Sorry, I grew up in the 80s. I have a very st stereotypical mind of um, colors. <laughs> of course, uh, it's still in the hospitals as well. So, like, if you if you um, have if you go to the hospital and you have a boy who's born, then there's these ladies that make um, hats for newborn babies. And it's all volunteer work and it's it's really sweet. These little old ladies, they'll they'll create these little onesies or not onesies, these little hats to put on, on the newborn babies. And um, it's all knit. Very soft material. And if you have a girl, you get a pink one. And if you have a boy, you get a blue one. <sighs> so I mean the stere it, it's a stereotype, that's all. Traditionally, pink is the girl's color and blue is the boy's color, but that's neither here nor there because nowadays we have what's called uh, unicolors. So you the yellows and the greens, and that's just fine by me as well. Oh, I I thought I had more alphas than that. Okay, uh, well let's take a quick peek around. There's there's pink over there. Ah ha ha! Found you. I got you. And let's go this direction. Any more alphas? Do you guys see any more alpha axes or alpha boxes? It's kind of like a game of Where's Waldo. And by the way, if you don't know what Where, Where's Waldo is, then uh, you're probably new to the world. Um, <laughs> uh, where's Waldo is a, a children's book where you have to find the guy with the, the red striped hat and red striped shirt. <coughs> I don't see any more alphas, so I think alpha is good. Um, next is going to be beta, and I will I will break down my my marble machine over there if we need to. In fact, we are going to need to right now, aren't we? Oh my goodness! Oh no! All right, buddy, it's time to break you down into your components and move you out of the way. All right, there's the delays, or is it the sustains that? that that's a sustain. Uh, wait, hold on. There we go. Sustain. Boop. Like that. And move. Sust Not that. Don't move the floorboard. There you go. Signal disdain. <laughs> Signal disdain. Uh, disdain is. Never mind. <laughs> sustain. Sustain the signal. All right, uh, we can go ahead and just destroy the wedges. Destroy the wedge. Um, let's move this glass pane up with the rest of the glass pane. Let's rotate. By the way, huge, huge, huge shout out to Wolf because all of these, like, I don't know if you've seen this, this entire set of glass, this is gonna be for the, the walls going up for like second floor, third floor, stuff like that. She purchased all of these. It was like 800,000 in purchases of glass and she stacked them all on her base and one day she had them on there and she's like, Code, I've got a surprise for you. And I'm like, oh, okay. So I came over I'm like, oh my gosh. But I had to go and she's like, please, Code, you need these. So I'm like, okay, we can do this. Put your base like right next to mine and then we'll just start opening them and throwing them over there as fast as we can. <clears throat> so we, we were opening opening them on her base, placing them on my base. So that's why you got the weird uneven pattern all the way across there. But uh, people are, are looking at us going, how are you moving those so fast? Where are they going? So I just wrote back, hackers. <laughs> and they're like, oh no, I'm gonna report you. I'm like, oh, that's funny. Oh man. I, pro I probably shouldn't have done that. That was, that was mean. Wait, I don't know how to move that. I wanna move this right there. Move the wires out of the way. Here we go. Finished. Move that wire. Move and finish. By the way, Defaultio is working on Goop right now. G O O P. I don't know if Goop is the uh, the um, Projute game or not, but that is the. Intent. I, I think that's his new game that he's been working on, and I'm really excited for it. Uh, in fact, I'm I'm ready for it to be finished. 
because he said December, <coughs> uh, like Christmas of last year was, oh, hello, Axes, hiding over here in the corner. He said last year during Christmas time would probably be the release date, and I'm like, uh, okay, but it, it was not released, so a little bit of disappointment, but at the same time, I know how busy he is. I mean, I, I look and see how busy I am, and I'm like, really? You got time to go make these videos and these play these games? I'm like, yes, absolutely, I've got time to do this. Oops, that was not correct. All right, let's move that down there. There we go. Move. Can we get this lined up, please? Can this... This is not lining up whatsoever. Hmm. Maybe we should have turned these on their side. Oh, there it, oh, nice. Wait, <gasps> elevator, elevator? No, no, let's not, no elevator today. Maybe some other time. Why is these not, like it, it feels like they're getting stuck. Are they getting stuck? Yeah, this is horrible. Um, turn, turn. Rotate, turn, there. Let's just, let's just do this. Move this right here. No, I don't want it to move, there you go. We'll just line these up like that. And those can line up just fine. That's perfect, that's not perfect, that's no, that's, urgh. it's gonna bug me not getting it perfectly in lined. What, stop it. You? Not you. You. Come here. All right. There. Oh my goodness. You guys see that? That was. All right. Come on. Come on. Just get lined up and play nicely. There. Move. Now we should be able to just move these over here like that. Move this one. There we go. And we will invent something else with these, by the way. <clears throat> it was a little herky-jerky with, uh, uh, with the ball trying to go up there. Because the ball had to be constantly moving in order for the physics of the server to react and everything else. But it did work. I will admit it worked for like six of the, uh, the times that it went up. But after that, it was weird. All right, uh, rotate, turn, turn, turn. There we go. That's an and switch, right? I think so. That's an or switch. What's that in the middle? Hold on, let's move this. That's an or switch as well, so we can just toss that on top. Good. And what's this? That's an or gate. Or gate, not switch. Oh, gate. What's the difference code? Well, a switch is... Um, like this thing this this is a switch. It's a lever a toggle. That's a switch a gate takes two inputs compares them and then gives you an output So don't call it a, a switch And these things oh man I wish I had paid attention whenever I was purchasing them because I really wanted all of the uh laser detectors to work. Uh, somebody inside the comments said, well, why don't you make a, um, hold on, a wood sorting device that uses no conveyors. I'm like, hmm, how would I, oh, <gasps> ice. You could totally do that with ice. So I might do that. We'll, we'll see. We'll see where everything goes from here, Code. <laughs> All right. Today is just base clean. What, how far am? Oh, we're 19 minutes in. Okay, we we just got plenty of time. Plenty of time to finish out the uh, the bins and clean up the axes and get them in their proper places and everything sorted. <clears throat> If your base is messy like mine is, um, my dad said something to me today. Something very... 
Oh, I love that sound. Very enlightening. Don't get overwhelmed. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh gosh, oh gosh. I am, oh no, it's like domino effect. Don't get overwhelmed, he said. Do one little section at a time. And he, he was talking about moving houses and, and stuff like that because um, we've been moving my dad and he said, don't get overwhelmed. Do one little section at a time and do it correctly. Don't get distracted by other sections. Like that makes sense because that's totally what I do when my ADHD kicks in. I'll be like cleaning these axes over here, and then when I'm over here, I'll be like, "Oh man, I need to, I need to take this out." So let's start taking this out, and then I'll realize like the ladders are in the way, and the ladders need to go over there somewhere. And so he understands my ADHD, and I love that because he's got it as well. So okay, there's that. What are you doing? <laughs> Just hanging out with these chickens. Okay. Um, let's do two, drop, drop it like it's in times, there we go, and can I knock that down, of course I can, <laughs> was not the intent, um, wait, I can't pick up anything else, I gotta go fix those, how many more do we have over here, what, what kinds do we have, uh, have we placed fire axes in there? We have, okay. So, fire axe is my favorite axe because it's specific for a type of wood. It's the firewood. Not firewood, uh, lava trees. So, I'm ready for another specific axe. That's what I'm ready for like an ice axe that specifically cuts ice wood in like one or two chops, you know? Or if it's already out there and we just haven't found it yet. Because he, like, Defaultio tends to do that. He will, okay, I'm not dropping them correctly. Hold on, turn to the that direction. There we go, drop, 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 drop. Good deal. Oh, one more, one more. He will hide things and not tell anybody, and not say anything. All we see is, game was updated, and we're like, wait, what? So then the wiki team, they kick into full mode, and they're like, all right, guys, we got to find these. All right. <clears throat> oh, hold on. Why is this not? There we go. Okay. Two, 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 two. Two, 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 uh, two, two. Basically, um, a lot of people would have just moved the axes, picked them all up. They're, they're, they are one of the easiest things to move around. Probably could have picked up one more because you have a zero slot as well. Oh man, <laughs> getting crazy. Getting, getting crazy. And here we are. Thank you for tuning in on this Code Primate Picks Up His Base episode. We're now going to turn over to some ASMR as I get closer to my microphone and talk in a low tone. Hi, this is Code. <laughs> Just kidding. Just kidding. No ASMR. Well, the intent is definitely done. Like, uh, that looks much better than it was. And we got some organization going on. Not too bad. I might have to raise the walls on here. Raise the roof! <clears throat> Let's see. If I drop them fast, they're gonna jerk all over the place, aren't they? Oh gosh! Explosions! <laughs> wow. It just, it looks like a fire thing. <laughs> I love the particle effects, by the way. What was that? Did you guys see that? Oh, it, it was a tree, it fell down. Okay. Hello. I could use you. Hello, eyeball. I have a place for you as well. 
There you go. All right, let's go to one walls. Let's do smooth wall. We're gonna go rotate, turn, rotate. One there, one there, and one there. I'm gonna go rotate. Come on, come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. Just get on there, please. <sighs> okay, turn, turn. There it went. That's so weird. So weird. What a weird game. Why isn't it going in the thing? Go oh, to that side, please. Oh, oh. No. There it goes. Whew. Remember, if something's not fitting, or if it's not... <laughs> I don't have an axe on me to cut it. Okay, come here, end times. Uh, if something's not fitting, always rotate it and change its angle. See if you can can get it to act right. All right. I'm not used to that. There we go. Wait, where did... <laughs> Wait. Wait. Can you... Hold up. Did I just find a secret? Nope. See, see, I thought so. So you can only have a total of 10 items in your backpack. I was sitting, okay, so to give you an idea of what I was thinking, I thought if I put the blueprint up there out of my backpack and then I only had axes along the bottom, I'd get a tenth axe that I could carry. So it'd be one blueprint and ten axes. Not true. The um, the blue blueprints actually act as one of the axes, so. <sighs> oh well. There we go. Okay. And we're out. Got the end times axe, awesome sauce, and it's going in there. Boop. 99. 99%, and you couldn't go one more. All right, here we go. Slide. That did not slide. <laughs> oh, man. Oh. <laughs> slide. <laughs> there you go, buddy. There we go. Okay. We're good. All right. Let's look around. Do we have some cherry wood? Oh, we only have two minutes left. What? All right. We, uh, da, 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 da. I don't have, I don't have enough time. I don't have enough time. Where's the cherry wood? We used to have tons of it. There's some cherry wood. All right. Come here, buddies. Come here. I need, to, oh, wait, 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 wait. Ah, bah, look at that. I just remembered that I hid some at the very beginning. Uh, oh man. It was supposed to be hidden so people would be like, oh, that's just a piece of the, the build. No, it was it was me squirreling away some some cherry wood for the day that I would need it to build. Oh, please tell me I have enough. Please tell me I have enough. Ah, oh, I don't have enough. Okay, you know what we'll do? You know what we'll do? We're going to take this one, stick it over here. Look how much it is. 89%. We're going to take this one, stick it over here. How much is this one worth? 86%. Then we can take these little pieces. Come on, ice wood. Fill it in. Go. Nice. Nice. Like ice. <laughs> Get it? That's funny. And boom. Yes! So that'll give us three more slots. Let's see, let's just count how many more like kinds of axes we have. Regular axes, I'm not intending to do the same thing with. So, we do we already have chicken axes over there? We already have chicken axes. We need candy cane, um, beta? 
Did we take betas over? Beta, candy cane, and the bee's axe. I think that's it. I think that's it. Since we already have some chickens. Let's go ahead and pick up the chickens. But oh, that's not chicken. Get out of here. There we go. Chickens. Are we over? Oh, I'm over. I'm over. Uh, no. Don't be over, Code. Is that chicken? Yeah, it's got a smiley face on the handle. But it's not a smiley face. It's, it's an actual, like, chicken drumstick looking thing. Okay, so chicken axes. Oh, wait, 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 wait. There's a fire axe hanging out over here. Boom. So much organization, so much cleaning that we did tonight. And all in 30 minutes. 30 minutes? We're not getting it done? Are you kidding me? Sorry, that's from P90X. I probably should not have made that reference, but... Um, before you know it, I'm going to start working out again. Getting all moto. Motivational. 30 minutes or less. Hit the pause button if you need it. We'll be here when you get back. Parents, if you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> Hashtag, I know. <laughs> I'm just kidding. All right, guys. Um, let's leave it there for now. I, I, there's some so much more I could do, but, you know, 30-minute episodes. Trying to, trying to keep it regular episodes for you guys. Thank you, everyone, for watching this Lumber Tycoon 2 uh, cleaning episode with me, Heath Haskins, Code Primate, on slot number two as we pick up everything and, and build and have awesomeness and just talk because that's that was the the intent of this one was to get to talk and let you know my ADHD mind and where I'm at with things. So love you guys very much. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe down below. These are your choice. They are not intended to be any kind of like, you got to subscribe now or the world's going to come to an end tomorrow because that's the way things are. That's not true at all. In fact, the people that say stuff like that, I kind of laugh and giggle at. I'm like, hey, I'm not going to subscribe anyway. So <laughs> if you want to subscribe, absolutely go for it. But if you don't want to, thanks for being here and watching. Love you guys very much. Have a great night. We'll talk to you very soon. Outro.